changes. In 1776, this great nation accepted that armed conflict was the only way to preserve our rights to life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. If our founding fathers could only see us now. From Antietam to Amiens, Okinawa to Anchorage, we have fought. And now, the Red Menace is at our doorstep. Democracy itself is under threat of annihilation. That is why today, July 4th, 2076, 300 years after our great nation began, we gather together to honor the completion of Vault 76. This sprawling underground shelter may have been engineered by Vault Tech, but it was built by you, the good people of America, so that if the bombs do come, if the end does come, our way of life will endure. But not everyone will be saved. Those chosen to enter this vault must be our best and our brightest. For when the fighting has stopped and the fallout has settled, you must rebuild. Not just walls, not just buildings, but hearts and minds, and ultimately, America itself. So as we stand here today, we pray that the world will know peace. But if that is not our destiny, if war must come, we stand together knowing that here in Vault 76, our future begins.
task with nothing less than the rebuilding of America. Such a huge responsibility. Just know that vault -Tec is proud of you. I am proud of you. When you hear this, it means I've been gone for several hours. I've got my own mission out there in Appalachia. This is the Overseer, signing off. Mr. Michael? Hello? Oh, finally! I feared you'd never wake up. Don't you remember? It's Reclamation Day. Time to leave the vault. Most of the others have already gone. Best get cracking. Come, come. The country's not going to rebuild itself. Constant alert for the clicky click of your Pip Boy's built in radiation meter. I know it's cozy in here, but you'll soon be faced with a distinct lack of power and shelter. giant vault door alone, unless, of course, you're next to someone else, which I'd recommend, actually. Rusty shack at a time.
not possess the skills necessary to accomplish anything. I'm sure of this. Sir, I found this holotape on the Overseer's terminal. Leave a little listen. Seems you should meet her at her camp, just down the road. Overseer's log, or should I say, direct communication. Because whoever is listening to this had the moxie to try to find out where I've gone. But I'm glad you did. Truth is, I need your help. I've been given a task, and I've decided to break protocol and tell you what it is. Because if there's one thing I've learned in these past few years, it's that we need to rely on each other. There were three active nuclear silos in Appalachia before the bombs fell. They blew up the world before. We can't let it happen again. So we've got to locate and secure all of the silos. Or die trying. Hopefully the former. But it's been 25 years. I just don't know what we're gonna find out there. Or where to start. My directive was to go to the nearest population center and assess the situation. I'll set up a camp on the way once I get my bearings. Find me there.
Ranger's log, south of Vault 76. I, I knew this wasn't going to be the Appalachia I remembered, but... Mutated animals? Haywire bots? And... No people so far. We have to be ready to rebuild in... What I can confirm is... Hostile territory. Fortunately, Vault Tech was prepared. You see this? The cooking station, the stash box, the workbenches, all built with the camp. You need a home base out there. The construction and assembly mobile platform is designed to give you one. Just add resources, planning, and a little elbow grease. When you move your camp, everything you've built is stored, ready to be placed back down in the new area. Use this to establish a foothold whenever you're in unfamiliar territory. I've left my camp behind so you can use it. I know I'm breaking my own advice by not taking it. But after seeing Appalachia for myself, I need to make sure every resident of 76 has a safe haven they can start from. I'll make do without it. If it's still standing, the town of Flatwoods is further down this road. Find me there. This is the Overseer, signing off. <laughs>